give you an example, Tammy Sutton. When she took on as a tax collector, it was the same thing. She could only certify what she was collecting, and so she didn't collect the full amount. And she, you know, she, she collected what um, a percentage of that 35 that she's getting now. I think she only took $10 for a tax cert in her first year, I think. $10, $15. So it's really just kind of the opposite of what you're saying. I, at this point, have three years of data. And so at this point, I should get the $35 in my view. I don't know how the solicitor feels if he feels um, that this is an awkward time for me to be coming forth with this request. Is this an awkward time since I just got elected and I'm in first year before your term? I don't really have an opinion on that. I mean, I think that's up to counsel to vote um, from a legal standpoint. Counsel has the authority at any time to, to vote and to set fees for uh, their officers. So I, I think that counsel is certainly within its right and power to change the fee right now. Um, the ordinance can certainly be, we would have to sort of come back again. It can be redrafted uh, to provide that it the fee change in the event that there is a new tax collector, um, but you know, I, right now the ordinance that's before council is certainly appropriate from a legal standpoint. Can I? Uh, sure. I, I I understand your concerns, but I, I think it's a pretty straightforward thing. I mean, it, she's asking for parity to the other collectors in, in the uh, the school district, and um, you know. The timing is the timing, so I, I, I don't think it's it's worth a prolonged discussion. I, I think we we asked the solicitor to to draft the ordinance last time, and and I'm in favor of passing it. And um, it just seems like a, a fair thing to do for parity among among the tax collectors in uh, in in the you know the uh, school district, and uh, just clarify that the tax itself or the fee comes from um, the trend you know the people who are buying in real estate so it happens at the uh, it's not an increase in our taxes mm -hmm. so it's a it's a fee that's gets paid at the closing of real estate so I'm, I'm fine with it I, I, do, I, okay. ahead, John. I, I do have and I support the increase but the one question that's raised is if at the end of four years a new tax collector comes on the way this is written they would charge thirty five dollars but only provide one year of tax certification then have to go to Doylestown and pay another fifteen or twenty dollars so should it read that a year one year two I, I mean because if three years is what is needed really doubling the fee well, that, that's what I was saying before. I mean, if you want, the, the ordinance can be redrafted to provide that. Or, you know, if Judy decides that she's not going to run again for tax collector, then it could be addressed. council can, prior to the new year beginning, mm -hmm. reduce the fee under those circumstances. I mean, it's not, okay. it's not set in stone once it's changed. It can be changed again. Okay. I will point out, though, before council acts, that we do need to determine the effective date of the ordinance. Um, so prior to acting, I just do, do want to amend the motion to provide that the ordinance would be effective. And I would suggest May 1st of this year to give uh, the borough time to update the fee schedule. Would that be sufficient, Marsha? So if I can ask. Do we, do we open for public now, or is it? Yeah, we can do that. Yeah. Are you, I'm sorry. You want uh, to correct me if I'm wrong, but at the last council meeting, we had a discussion, and we voted a fee increase for tax collector. All we're doing right now is, is, is authorized or is, is voting on the resolutions. We voted a tax increase five to one. Yeah, we, we did. We authorized we advertisement. To authorize a tax increase. And it appears to me that you're backing away from that, no, from your desire to tax increase. Amendment. Oh, okay. <laughs> is there any discussion on the amendment? No. I, okay. I have one. Um, sure. uh, Judy, one question real quick. We talked uh, at work session, I guess, I'm not sure if we did it at this meeting, about what this really is in actual dollars based, let's say, upon last year's experience. So just for the anybody out there going, I don't know what they're talking about in terms of real dollars here. Is it 25000 or is it 2000 or 
Yes. If you had the increase based upon last year. All right. I had done a little homework before that work session in anticipation of questions, and I did have that dollar figure. I don't have it now. I probably only earn a couple thousand. What is it? A couple thousand dollars a year in tax fees? That's all we're talking about. I, I thought it was between two and three thousand. But Isn't that what I just said? No, oh, okay. <laughs> that's a couple right? thousand. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, but that, that's what we're talking about. A couple thousand dollars. Yeah, okay. it's um, it's 77 suits or something. I'm trying to remember. Um, right. And I I, I don't remember off the top of my, but it's it's not a lot of money. I'm okay. talking to three thousand dollars. That three thousand's high. So Thanks. that's what it is. Okay. Any any other discussion? Okay. Not ready to call the question. All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Nay. Motion carries. Thank you. Uh, Next, I'll ask for a motion to approve resolution 04-13-10B, amending the Newtown Borough fee schedule, increasing the fee to be paid to the tax collector for tax certifications from $20 to $35. So moved. Second. I don't believe we need the Judy to come back up. No. So. So. Okay, so this is just uh, um, bringing the fee schedule in line with the ordinance? Correct. Okay. Um, was it seconded? Yeah. Okay. It was moved and seconded. Any discussion? Okay. If not, call the question. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Motion carries. Next, um, I'll ask for a motion to adopt ordinance number 702. Amending Article 1, Chapter 75 of the Code of the Borough of Newtown entitled Emergency Management Organization by modifying the succession of authority to declare a local disaster emergency. If it's seconded, I'll give a brief discussion on the record. So, so moved. <laughs> Second. Um, right now, under the Emergency Management Services Code, which is Pennsylvania statute, each uh, borough has the authority to give its mayor um, the authority to declare an emergency. Um, obviously, the council has that authority, but under the circumstances, they're not going to be able to get together in time to do that. Uh, presently, there is an order of succession on the books that grants that authority to the president of borough council, then the vice president, then the mayor, and then the emergency management coordinator. Under the state law, uh, only the mayor is permitted to be given that authority. Um, However, if the mayor is, is absent, then the president of borough council sitting as the mayor would have the authority or would be able to get that authority. And in the absence of both the mayor and the president, then the vice president would be in that position. So the revised ordinance provides that the succession of authority to declare a local disaster emergency shall be as follows. One, mayor of Newtown Borough. Two, president of borough council acting as mayor of Newtown Borough in the absence of the mayor of Newtown Borough. And three, vice president of borough council acting as mayor of Newtown Borough in the absence of the mayor of Newtown Borough and the absence of the president of Borough Council. Okay, so where are we with this? We have a motion? Um, motion, motion has been seconded. seconded if there's okay. any discussion. Okay, any discussion? Yeah. The need for this clarification came about in the midst of our major snowstorms this year when we realized that the order of succession in that ordinance was not, did not meet state law. Okay. Uh, any discussion among the public? Okay, I guess we can call the question. All those in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Motion carries. Uh, 